Sir, India is going to host the summit. Yep. The Indian Prime Minister is going to address it. Mm-hmm. What do you have to say about that? Okay. Um, I really like to hear from him, the Prime Minister of India, that the Indian government will continue to support uh, the Buddhist religion as a whole, but in particular Buddhist education mm-hmm. in this country by supporting the idea of set, sub, setting up first and second and third, if possible, the Buddhist university full-fledging. I mean, not only mixing with other faculty, because Buddhism has very broad knowledge and also living style and practices and so on to teach to the world. I mean, you may have enough teachings personality here in, uh, in India, or you can invite more, but this is the right place. And I mean, I'd really like to see the Prime Minister could announce something, mm. news, not only the old program mm. on that. And particularly because many monks in, in Indian are quite, shall I to say, quite mm. poor to pursue their higher education. Mm. And then uh, there should be some program to support people who prospectively Mm. Uh, uh, take advantage of uh, higher education in university to mm. become a good citizen of, of Indian uh, again to help to balance the minor role of Buddhism here in this country mm. to, to make sure that Buddhism is not lag behind everyone else in this country and I'd like to see that happen mm. to, re- to rescue all the heritage mm. uh, like um, the, some caves uh, or some, you know, uh, Buddha holy places is also important mm. to attract more tourists to this country because uh, this is another uh, consideration, uh, serious concern of us. Mm. But I think to between the two, the Buddhist education for Buddhist people in India, to me, mm. is more important. A long-term project uh, mm. for uh, Indian government to, to help mm. than uh, immediate uh, aims of attracting, you know, more and more tourists, uh, Buddhist tourists, come to come to the country. Mm-hmm. Okay.